Hey, Mama Lamas, how you doing today? Grab your iced coffee and a fuzzy blanket because I'm about to show you five small mods for realistic gameplay. So today I have five mods for your game that will absolutely enhance your realistic gameplay. You know, it's all about the little things, guys, like Slice of Life, MC Command Center, all great mods. You know, they're cool and all, but these mods will definitely add a little sprinkle of realism to your family. Our test subjects for these five mods will be Benjamin and Finn Beckett, my new journey to Batu family but two but two <laughs> I have no idea the correct pronunciation for that, so go ahead and let me know. But their create a sim video should be out tomorrow, which I know it seems kind of weird to post a video with them before their create a sim, but you will not get their full backstory until tomorrow's video. So make sure you definitely subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you do not miss it. Fortunately though, I actually do have a speed build out right now on my channel of this home right here, which also has a lot of backstory to it. So if you guys want to go ahead and check this out, it will be at the top right hand corner for you but anyways before i get a little too carried away with some self promo <laughs> um without further ado let's go ahead and get into it so our first mod on the list is called the service animal and guide dog mod by your false hope on patreon so basically if you have a sim that is blind or otherwise handicapped whether it be physically or even mentally you can assign any of your pets the service animal trait which monty has over here where's monty there you are, super cute. And basically a cat or a dog can have that trait, but the guide dog trait is only for dogs only and it's only for blind sims. So basically in the rewards store, let's see, your sim can purchase this service animal owner trait, which is gray here because I purchased it for Finn already. But if your animal has the service animal trait and your sim has the service animal owner trait, basically what's gonna happen is when your sim is around that pet, they're gonna get a moodlet, which should show up here in a second when she's around Monty. Let's see. Yes, here it is. So working together, Finn is feeling better with their service animal around. So say Finn here deals with depression or anxiety or any other mental health disorder, she'll be able to feel a lot better around Monty because Monty has prior training as a service animal. I do believe cats can be a service animal as well, which that's super cool for all of you cat people like myself. Oh, she's talking to her dad. She's like, no one likes me. No one will ever like me why bother with anything anymore <laughs> and that's like i always love you honey i'm like your mom but <laughs> i'm gonna spill that tea later actually that tea is in this feedback video <laughs> so but child anyways so this next mod is called the refer mod by neon ocean on mod the sims and it's an awesome way to promote diversity and inclusivity in your game so with the fairly new update that came with realm of magic i believe which allows your sims to be non-binary uh, this mod also allows you to choose their respective pronouns for themselves. So say early on in Finn's life, she knew that she wanted the pronouns she or her. So basically you click on your sim, go to neon ocean, refer, and then pronoun settings. And then you'll go to pronouns and basically you have this whole list of different pronouns that you can choose for your sims. So we got she, her, he, him, they, them, zzer, z, her, z, them, or x, z, I, I have no idea, um, a, m, and it. So basically, let's say she wanted she, her in the beginning. So now her pronouns will be she, her. So the way that the notifications up here will refer to Finn, they will say she or her. So Finn earned this or Finn found this. But if she wanted to change her pronouns, we could go to the same place. So refer pronoun settings and we can do they, them. So let's try to start a new skill so we can kind of see what that looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and have Finn bake... Um, just a few pre-mixed brownies and we'll see the notification that pops up here when she learns to bake. All right, here it is. So Finn's newly acquired baking skill will allow them to combine butter, sugar, and other ingredients. So basically before the pronoun change, um, it would say her. So Finn's newly acquired baking skill will allow her. But once you change the pronouns, it'll automatically change the referral to you in the notifications and other UIs to your preferred pronouns. Now, according to the the creator's mod the sims profile it is not currently an available option to ask people for their preferred pronouns or add your own pronouns yourself but i think they do plan on adding those features very soon or eventually at least because i think that would be a really really cool addition but yeah i'm loving this mod and when you go to neon ocean you can also visit their website or you can obviously support them because this mod is awesome and uh, visit the mod page deep 
debug stuff, stuff like that. So this mod is definitely a small one, but it is a good way to let your Sims have a little bit of fun without spending so much money. And that is the Play Cards Anywhere mod by Plastic Box on Mod The Sims. And literally all it is, is it gives you the option to play cards with other Sims without having to buy the game table. So here are the cards right here. And literally all I did was go into build mode and type in card over here and you just pull it out and you kind of have to set it without a table and then put the chairs and then put the table under it so it'll work. But let's go ahead and play cards with dad. So yeah, I had to move the table because it wasn't letting me do it over here for some reason. I was like, oh crap, I hope this mod works, but it does. So definitely shouldn't have doubted this creator's skills. But yeah, they're just playing cards and we didn't need to buy the game table, you know, like the, the one where you can play cards or do don't wake the llama or whatever. So yeah, this is really, really awesome. And the creator, I believe, has a override for the cards on Mod The Sims. So basically you can make the cards blue, I think, instead of green if you wanted to. But yeah, they're just having some daddy-daughter time. I love it so much. And you know, they don't really get to have a lot of time to together since they're fighting the forces of evil you know what i'm saying but yeah just a small mod that'll let you play cards whenever you like so they're done playing cards and benjamin is feeling a little energized actually but not energized enough to take a whole jog if you know what i'm saying so we're gonna go ahead and go for a walk now this mod is by little miss sam and it's kind of an old mod it's it's older but i actually never downloaded it until now because you know i just thought taking my sims out for a jog would be better you know there's no need for them to go on a walk but if you think about it like if your sims are having a rough time you know they're stressed or they're sad whatever it is they can just go and take a walk and it is supposed to aid in some of their moodlets so say you had a stressed moodlet a sad moodlet tense whatever it is it will make it more likely to go away and your sim will be a lot more happier and relaxed and i love how it's not like too long either too long of a walk you know we're already pretty much uh three quarters of the way done so i like how it's short quick to the point but it also makes your sim a lot more happy all right you guys so it's getting just a little bit late it is around 5 30 so it's gonna be getting dark soon and finn is gonna be getting tired soon as well so the final mod we are gonna be checking out is the wash face at sinks mod by lemon shushu on mod the sims and the name of the mod you know it's pretty self-explanatory all you have to do is take your sims to the sink and select wash face and what this is gonna do is if your sim is wearing makeup it will come off so it kind of looks like she's crying but you know i mean the animation does work so yep she's just washing her face which it does make sense you know the animation but yeah after that her makeup did come off which i'm gonna go ahead and pause so you guys can <laughs> actually see but her makeup did come off and those things under her eyes are actually tattoos so you know obviously they're not gonna come off but if she decided to wash her face and she wanted to put on her makeup again we can select her and do apply makeup again and her makeup should come back on yeah so there we go her makeup is back on and i actually read on the website that this mod is also compatible with slight of life so if you do wash your face often that will actually reduce your chance of getting acne from the slice of life mod which i think it's so freaking sick that mod creators will make other mods compatible with their mods and stuff like that i think that's really really cool but yeah finn did get a moodlet that says shiny face from washing face finn's face is shining brighter than ever washing face is not only good for hygiene it makes you feel fresh too so yeah mama llamas those are all the mods that i have for you today i'm gonna go ahead and send finn and benjamin to sleep because they have a lot of work to do you know <laughs> you know fighting the dark side and all that stuff must be pretty tiring okay looks like they don't want to sleep so <laughs> never mind also what is swarm by bees all the way out here that's a joke that's a freaking joke how are you guys seeing this how <laughs> Finn, no! Oh no, she got stung. How did that happen? The bees are out here. Okay, you know what? Never mind. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and let me know which mod you like the most. Firstly, for me, I would have to say the refer mod just because I love the fact that not only can our sims be non-binary in the game, but we can also choose their pronouns. So that's super awesome. But don't forget to leave a like on this video if you want to see more mod reviews and don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you get notified whenever I post a new video. As always, don't forget to subscribe to become a Mama Llama. Bye y'all.